Hi, this is Pete, and I'm going to teach you how to play three water games in one, hopefully less than one minute and 30 second explanation. What we're going to do is we're going to put empty buckets on that side, and we're going to split the group up into about four or five people per team. And so we're going to put one bucket per team. So if you have 20 people, you need four empty buckets on that side. Then we're going to have a water source on this side, about 50 feet away, or 100 feet away, depending on how big your field is. And our water source will be maybe a full bucket for each group of people, or maybe one big vat of water. It doesn't matter. Whatever works. Now, we need a way to transport that water from one end of the field all the way to the other end of the field. And that is where the variations come. Game one, the sponge and bucket brigade, taught to me by Miss Me in second grade. And what we do is we take a sponge, we dip it into that bucket. Each team has their own sponge. One person puts the sponge on their head and balances it on their head and tries to get to the other bucket and then squeezes the sponge water out and then runs back, gives the sponge to the next person. You can't throw the sponge. You can't hold it on your head. You have to balance it. And so you can't you know, run with it anywhere else. You have to make sure that while you're moving, it is balanced on your head. The second variation is the couple holes relay, where you do the same thing except we give you a hole, a hole. We give you a cup that is filled with holes. And it works a lot better, I believe. We take a Dixie cup, we put about 10 holes in that, and that's how you have to hold it, and you have to hold it above your head, and put your fingers in all the holes, and try to keep all the water from leaking out, and then dump it in your bucket. Of course, the team with the most uh, water in their bucket at the end of the game wins. Now, I told you there would be a third variation, which there is, and the third variation is the sponge bum relay, and that is where you partner up with the person who is right behind you, and you take that sponge, and you have to hold it in between your two uh, backsides while running down to the end and then squeeze the uh, sponge out. Now that was a little over two minutes. I'm sorry I knew I would take a little long. But that's three water games and we will see you guys on the field.